Happy Father's Day, everybody. It is Casey Walker, 805. Wishing uh, all my fellas out there, because I got a chance to look at my uh, my stuff. I got the new app from uh, from uh, YouTube, and I see that 90% of the people that watch these videos are men. So to all my guys out there, man, that uh, have children um, celebrating that, or you were out with your dad or your brother, uh, happy Father's Day to you, and well wishes to you and your family. Uh, without further ado, I'm going to get into these cards. Uh, and at the end, I'm going to do some shout outs. Uh, maybe periodically through, uh, through here, I will. I do have some cards um, at the end of this stack that Ricky Russo sent to me uh, out of the kindness of his heart. I just want to thank Ricky. Uh, sometimes I know he gets a little flustered because uh, people only want, 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 and they don't show love back. And uh, just because I comment, I don't want him to think that I don't show love back. Sometimes I got to get enough cards together to make a video. But thank you, Ricky. Uh, you guys, please spread the message, man. Thank you, Ricky. And uh, let's look out for our godfather, all right? The boss, he needs all the love he can get. Um, this is a card that I have multiples of. So if you want this card, please hit me up. It is a Gary Sanchez. It is a rookie. So hit me up if you want that. It's kind of an odd card here. Uh, I'm not exactly sure um, how many were made. Uh... It's from 1990. It's from Tim Brown when he played at the uh, University of Notre Dame. Um, I sent Jerry. I'm um, sending Jerry Jacobson the uh, the Elway version I have of this back from when he played. Um, if anybody wants this, if you're a Raiders fan, Tim Brown fan, or a Notre Dame fan, hit me up. I'll get that to you. Um, I had to show this. I'm not sure if I showed it again since I changed my camera angle. Uh, some cards I'm going to be re-showing, and this is a uh, Honus Wagner. Um, it's obviously a newer card, but ju just amazing the life on his face that he lived. And uh, I'm a sucker for these 87 Tops minis, any minis I like, but these 87 Tops minis. Uh, this is going out to someone, but I just wanted to show it because I think it's a great card. So, uh, <clears throat> Mark from Kentucky, uh, if you see this in a uh, mail package coming soon, I know you're a Longoria um, PC guy, so uh, I figured. When I saw it for sale, I bought it because I knew you would appreciate it. I have a growing collection of my own, and I'll pick me up one when I need to, but I uh, definitely want to get that to you. Adam Jones, one of my favorite guys. That's his. Picked up a Brooks Robinson. I have a Jackie Robinson coming. I have a uh, uh, um, Hank Aaron coming. There's, there's a few I have coming. Um, beautiful cards. So Michael Walker, Bowman Chrome, rookie card. Uh, I like him, although he plays for uh, our mortal enemies. I'm a Dodger fan. He plays for the uh, Cardinals, but great card. And I'm picking up Gurley's when I can because I think he's going to have a bounce back season. So um, that's another one. I, th I think I have another one of these already, but I picked up another one. That's a Gurley. Uh, picked up another one of these chippers. Main reason is because um, out of all his rookies, I'm really fond of this one. The uh, gold leafing and um, just the pose, the photography, the blue in the background with the sky, just an amazing card. Uh, this guy's having an insane season. Don't have to say anymore. Solid player, top to bottom. Somebody you should be collecting. Uh, so no, um, I started buying some of his cards by just looking at some of his stats online from last year. And then as the season started, he kind of had it a good year. So I had to double back and get some more. So uh, I have one of these already, maybe two. And uh, if you want one, let me know. I picked it up. Uh, it's a beautiful card. There's another Sano. Um, it is Stadium Club. Uh, and I know he's kind of hot right now. Uh, but I got it at a great price. And uh, look at that photography, man, with lights and the people in the background. That's just nasty. Um, this is Craig Biggio, um, Tops Gold. Uh, I love all the Topps Gold cards, uh, and this is like his second or third year card, but Hall of Famer, Topps Gold for under a buck, got to have it. Uh, and this is one of my main PC guys, uh, Mike Evans in football, Andrew Jones is one of them in baseball, that is a Topps Finest, uh, Blue Chips, just an amazing card, see those gold waves in the background, just an amazing card. It's another uh, Andrew Jones uh top the upper deck company star rookies um mm. 
just a beautiful card. Um, and his home runs that he hit, uh, his gold gloves that he got, um, and the RBIs and the stolen bases. Um, maybe five or ten years from now would have got him in the hall. Maybe it still might. But uh, he played in an arrow. Guys were on many, many steroids and doing crazy things. So we don't know if he's going to get in, but I hope he does. Uh, out of 550, Antonio Gates, second year. Uh, ultimate collection. Beautiful card. Chargers fan and a uh, 49ers fan. So Jason Hayward, a lot of guys have kind of written him off. He's still young, maybe like 27. Still got some years ahead of him. And uh, I just like the card. I got it for cheap. Um, anything chrome for cheap, I'm in on it. Um, big fan of this card. I picked it up for a pretty good price. It's Bowman Chrome, Andrew Jones, and Bundy. A couple of guys I like from the All-Star game. Just a beautiful card, 2012. Awesome. Got to love it. Uh, Michael Walker, again, picking up some of his stuff. Not exactly sure I just caught, caught the bug. Remember some of the times he beat the Dodgers and said, saw his stuff uh, going for cheap. Uh, got this for my brother, but I got doubles of it. Garrett Cole, rookie. Uh, Chrome, again, you know, anything Chrome that's uh, of a good player that I can get for a decent price, I'm on it. And speaking of that, Bowman Chrome, rookie card. Carl Edwards Jr., love it. Uh, Manny, Andrew Jones, uh, David Justice, Kenny Lofton, a um, handful of guys. Jeter in the 90s that really, really uh, had me following baseball and, and, and a fan, even though I wasn't collecting. Uh, that's his rookie. Great card. Uh, another great card here, Mike Evans. I mean, Bowman Chrome, um, rookie card, top shelf. You can see the gold shining. Um, this is Marcus Stroman. I think he's on his way to breaking out uh, here sometime this year and then explode the next couple years and being a real ace. Um, and I just like what he did at the World Baseball Classic. So I'm going to pick up his cards even though they're not worth anything. Uh, Chris Archer, Future Stars, um, kind of picking up a couple of things here and there. We'll see what happens. Uh, I like the kid so far. Uh, what do you know? Another Andrew Jones. Um, this is Long Distance Connections, Upper Deck. To me, a, a really beautiful card. Uh, I love the little creasing, the little, uh, uh, it looks like crimpling, uh, the Crips. I know that's not the right terminology, but I felt like saying Crips because that's where I grew up at. But Andrew Jones, um, another card of his. I'll always pick up his stuff, especially any kind of inserts or stuff like that. Uh, two of the guys I like right now, especially Carl Edwards Jr. Uh, and Schwarber. You know, hopefully he'll come on. But that's a great card. And then this last, these last four. Again, let me reiterate, Ricky Russo. Thank you, sir. Please, someone let him know. If you see this video, I don't have that many followers, but if somebody sees this, leave a comment and tell Ricky that I appreciate him. Um, I watch all his videos. Sometimes I don't comment because there's a lot of people on there that are thirsty for cards and are, are you know, are kind of, you know, uh, I don't want to say kissing butt, but doing things to get cards and he's called it out. And so I kind of just try to lay low and and do me, but I'm uh, really, really appreciative uh, of the stuff that he's done for me. And uh, this is a short print, uh, Joe Morgan, and it is of the Donruss. Um, I think it's the 82 kind of remix. So uh, Joe Morgan right there, beautiful card. Here's another, uh, it's, it's a limited print. I don't know what the print is, but it's the gray border, Ryan Braun, uh, same stuff. And then because Ricky Russo knows I'm a Dodger fan, he sent me the uh, Maeda rookie card. Um, it is um, Bowman's Best, which is just a filthy set, uh, and that's his rookie, so shout out to Pepino Man and our Dodgers, uh, and last but not least, it is Nomar Mazzara, it's his rookie card, again, Bowman's Best, just really great looking cards, if you just look at all the work they've done in the background to make these cards look good, so that's it, man, and um uh, 
I'm appreciative. Shout out, I'm going to go down my list. Uh, Elite Code 3, my man Nolan, Michael Fabian, uh, Mark from Kentucky, uh, the Car Junkies, Nate and Eric, Aaron619, uh, who's just an awesome, solid guy who knows the history of the game. I always learn from uh be more greg star dog jack frost uh pepino man take a minute and check out card crush 365 he has an awesome channel the guy is super cool and i know he uh moves cards at a really um reasonable price so check him out when you can uh let me see where was i at uh dave's midlife card crisis i wouldn't even be in the hobby right now if it wasn't for him so thank you dave for just introducing me to some great people via online uh mike O. uh who else am i thinking about right now um db tiller uh who has the greatest uh vintage uh card collection maybe next to uh jackify I mean, those guys' vintage card collections are crazy. Uh, back when I used to work in the music business, I could have sto stood toe-to-toe -to -toe with them and bought that stuff. But uh, when you start working with kids in group homes and when you start donating your time to the community and you start coaching basketball and um, trying to get kids into college, it doesn't pay a lot. So uh, I had to fall back. But I try to do what I can with the limited resources that I can and anything extra that I have. Um, after I take care of the kids and the people that I coach and donate my time to, it goes to the cards. That's why you don't see any really crazy high value cards, but you see stuff that I'm passionate about and that I like. Um, who else, uh, before I get out of here, is there anybody that I'm missing? Uh, Be more Greg, I think I mentioned him already. Uh, if I haven't mentioned you, it's not because uh, you, you, you're somebody I'm forgetting about. It's just uh, there's a lot of guys out there I have a lot of love for. Mark from Kentucky, such a solid dude, man. The salt of the earth, great guy. Uh, Ray from Philly, I mean, how do you get better than that? He has a son in the uh, collecting with him and um, just an awesome thing. Uh, speaking of that, Jay McGillicuddy, I saw yesterday where he sent uh, uh, a package to uh, Ray's son, Ray Ray. So just guys doing what they're supposed to be doing taking out taking care of the community and looking out for each other um i always got extras and stuff to send out if you ever want anything let me know jerry jacobson i got a package coming from you there's like five that are in the works but it takes me a little longer to get it together because of my limited resources all right um got any questions comments concerns leave them below please like please share please tell somebody about the channel i'm trying to get it up so i can uh um, do a contest, which I've been waiting to do. I'm just trying to get to 100 so I can do a contest. So help me out. Pepino, man, send some guys my way. Uh, you know, help a boy out, man. All right, once again, congratulations to all you dads uh, and all you fathers and, and sons and that were with your brothers and your kids today. Uh, that is a rare gift that you get a chance to spend time with your family and uh, enjoy that. I hope you had a great time. I hope you had a great Sunday. And uh, I'll see you when I see you. Keep the hobby alive. Never stop collecting. It's your boy.